Now, this video, I'm going to show you how you can install the Vertex Animation Toolset for Unity. So, this is important that you follow this video before you actually move into the other videos about using the Vertex Animation Tools. So, first of all, is actually installing the SideFX Lab Toolset. So, if you have not installed them or you need to update them, you can go here to Windows and you see SideFX Lab. So, click on that and this menu will pop up where you can actually update the toolset. So, you can press Update to get the newest version. So you might want to disable production build so you have actually the newest version. So make sure you are using the latest version of the Side Effect Labs toolset to have every to have the most up-to-date files. So once that is done, you might want to restart Houdini so the tools get loaded incorrectly. So when your Houdini is restarted, we can go to our outputs. And now we're going to type in our vertex animation toolset. So if you can load this node, that means you actually have access to the vertex animation toolset. So make sure your menu also looks the same as mine, because this is the latest version here now. And let's hear, and very interesting with this note is that actually there is some documentation included. So we're going to go here to real time shaders. We're going to set this to unity and we're going to press the button. This button will open information about how you should install the plugin. So here we have package installation info, and we also have here information about how to set certain import settings. So most of the time, or the main thing that is interesting here is the installation info for the package. In Unity, I'm going to show you how you can install the package. You can again read it from the doc or you can just follow here along. What we have to do is we have to open our package manager. So we're going to go to Window, Package Manager, and it will show you all the packages you have installed. So currently I already have installed the SideFX Vertex Animation Set. So let's add that to your project as well. So what we want to do is click on the plus icon and we're going to say add a package from the disk. So where do I find this package? If you have, you have to go to your documents and where your Houdini information is actually saved. So then we have to actually go to our SideFX Labs tools. And in there, we have to press the version that you're currently using. And then again, go to SideFX Labs. And in here, you will actually find the information for Unity. Now here we have some shaders. Let's click on shaders. And then here we have different Unity versions. So I'm using here the latest version with Vertex Animations 3. So my Unity project itself is also Universal Render Pipeline. And specifically here, I'm using Unity 2021.2.0b9. So make sure your Unity version is also the same or higher. So now let's open here our Universal Pipeline. And we're just gonna now here click on the package and select open. And then when everything goes right, you will now have the side effects vertex animation texture tool set or package. Now to double check this package, we're going to actually go here to our packages in our project, and you should be able to see here our side effects vertex animation texture. So open that. And in there, we can again see our package installation guide or an import settings. We can also here see our editors and shaders. So we have presets and shaders. So here we can actually find our shader graphs and also our sub shader graphs. So when you see all of this information, that means your tool is working. So for more information now on how to use the vertex animation tool set, I can recommend you watching the videos here where I can explain how to use each mode of the vertex animation tool set to import certain data like fluids, destruction, clot simulation, and other things. So that was it for this video. I hope you enjoyed it and thank you for watching.